Hi, I'm Rob Lindsay, teaching professional here at Marsh's Golf Club. Today I'm down at the first tee and would like to talk about making good decisions when teeing off on par fours and par fives. One way to take some pressure off and, and better your chances at having a good shot into the greens or, or laying up is to pick out a big target area. A nice way to do that is if you have a laser, uh, it, it can sort of define these areas and uh, you can have a good chance at, at knowing exactly what they are. So right now, I'm going to measure a couple areas, one on the far left, because it's possible to go through the fairway here, uh, down the fairway, so I want to find out how, that, how far that is to go through the fairway. So as I'm finding that out, it's about 195 yards to go through that fairway. Now obviously we have Marsh on the right, thus Marsh's golf club, and uh, we don't definitely want to go there. Uh, there's some bunkers guarding the fairway uh, down the center, and to get over those bunkers, it is about 175 yards. So right now, I'm thinking I can maximize my chances, widen the fairway if, if I keep the ball under 95 yards and hit it farther than, than 75 yards. So choose your club that gives you the most confidence and that can allow you to hit between those two yardages. And that then you'll have a, a landing area quite wide. Probably in this case it'll be about 75-80 yards and then you'll have a nice shot into the green somewhere between about 155 yards and 135 yards. Hope this helps. Uh, golf is a lot more fun when you keep the ball in play off the tee. I hope to see you around marshes.